Hello and welcome. David Strom here to talk about the different choices in email list server providers. In lesson nine, I talk about why you want to use these versus just sending emails from your ordinary inbox. You have three basic choices when it comes to list servers, the free, the cheap, and the pricey. While price alone is a good way to decide, there are some other reasons and I'll talk about them in a moment. The three that I'll talk about here in this video are Google Goop Groups, which is free, Mailman hosted by emwd.com for $4 a month, and iContact, which is the pricey one. All of these you need to assemble your email addresses that you want to start your list with in a word processing document or some other text file. Google Groups, which we're showing here, is not as good as Yahoo Groups in my opinion, and that's the subject of the next video lesson. There's one area where it really excels, and that's in the ability to set up large lists very quickly. Yahoo only lets you add 10 people a day to your list without asking them to opt in. Go to groups.google.com and click on the button here where it says to create a new group. You fill out this form. You choose the access level. I would say public or announcement is probably what you want to do. And away you go. Once your group is created, you'll get a web page that'll give you a link to a control panel. You click on the Invite Members button here and add members directly, and then you just copy and paste the members' email addresses into this box, as we talked about before. Mailman is a more professional piece of software, and it's hosted by this company, emwd.com, as I said, for $4 a month. Once you give them your credit card number and sign up, you get a web-based control panel that looks like this, and there's lots of different options. If you go into the membership management screen, you can click on this mass subscription list and, again, copy the addresses into this box here from your text file. As I said, it's $4 a month. This may not be enough for your purposes if you want to add web links in your emails and track who's clicking on what and have a little more color and, and so forth. You want eye contact. The downside with eye contact is that it's very pricey. As you can see, for big lists, it quickly adds up to over $50 a month when you've got more than 5,000 subscribers. But the advantage is you can get some very snazzy looking emails. Here's a email from my friend Paul Gillen. You can see there there's color, there's different web links that so you can go to different places on his site. Thanks for watching. I have another lesson that goes into more detail on how to use Yahoo Groups next.